Covenant. Watch the edges. Got it. processor we found before didn't need all these steps. Dad just interfaced with it directly. Let's not. Direct intervention was necessary in that case, but clearly unwise. Oh, look how high it is. Might be another gravity well. Well sealed. Damn. We can use the conduit for emergency power. Same as before. Better save the sorry. Take them out! Get anything on the scanner. The conduit splits and goes through each of those devices. Interfacing may complete the circuit and allow the well to open. If it gets us to the system lockdown, let's try. The gravity well remains in lockdown. glimpse into another civilization. Too bad we have to keep destroying them. They must be fighting for a reason. All these mysteries. Something big is happening in Andromeda Rider. Something magnificent. Let's find that system lockdown. This device appears defensive in nature. Power restored to the gravity well. The conduit leads down. Conduit fluid pressure is variable. There could be activity below. Then let's dig deeper. Barely any dust. How old is this place? Unknown. Radiation counts indicate the vault has been offline for several hundred years. Around the time the scourge appeared? That can't be a coincidence. Maybe the Scourge is why all this tech was abandoned. Dead. Without the conduit, there's not even enough power for the door.
crap. The conduit sprang a leak. Right over the console. If you try interfacing, you'll burn your hands off. And no fluid means no power. Damn it. Maybe that's why those devices up above were turned off. We're not turning back now. There has to be some way to fix the leak. Just a patch job, but it should hold. Nice work. If it's fixed, that console should work now. Looks like it worked. There's even a bridge. You're a pal, Ryder. Where are you going? We've got to be close to the system lockdown by now. First one gets the glory. We'll catch up. If we got that door working, too.
far, even for jump jets. Come to Andromeda, walk on air. Feel that? This whole platform's resonating with something. We must be close. No question. This is the heart of the vault. I've never seen anything like it. All conduits converge here, Pathfinder. That was... Any thoughts, Sam? Unknown. Though it appears related to the lockdown, an in-depth study may reveal its purpose. The system lockdown is disabled. The vault and the atmosphere processor should return to full operation. Ryder, you fixed the lockdown, didn't you? The whole place is lighting up. Power readings are off the chart. Really, really off the chart. But if it's back online, we should be good. Give a hell. Console is attempting surface reconnection. Come on! Vault restart is now complete. That was... Talk about a rush! Nothing like outrunning death. Or reactivating a huge mysterious vault. Nice going. Atmosphere processor is online, recovering last console activity. Is that the Helios cluster? Yeah. There we are. That's Eos. Something happened. Because we restarted the system? If that light is us, then... All these points could be vaults in other worlds. 
dormant like this one. Maybe. But why is there a whole network of them? What's all this for? Unless the Builders show up to explain themselves, all we've got is guesswork. So far we've seen bots, living plants, atmosphere processors. I once did supply runs for a council team that was seeding some ice planet's atmosphere trying to melt the ice caps. To help with support life. That first processor we saw was making things worse, but maybe it malfunctioned. Is that what these Builders were trying to do? Make worlds habitable? Even terraform a whole cluster? Hey, look there. That's different. Maybe it's active? We've got to go see. Sam? Extrapolating. These coordinates lie beyond the space we have currently surveyed, Pathfinder. Mark it on our charts. We need more to go on. Let's head up to the surface. I could use some fresh air. Support systems offline. Look at that sky. How? No atmosphere processor works that fast. If this effect is representative, Pathfinder, air and moisture patterns will show noticeable improvement. EOS could support an outpost. A foothold. That's all we need. Just enough to begin. This remnant technology could be the key to our survival, if we can control it. It changes whole planets. Let's go slow. We've got a lead. Sam marked it on the charts down there. That site is active, whatever it is. Who knows what we'll find there. We? You want to come along? I want to know what makes the Remnant tick. You've got a key to their technology. Or a crowbar, at least. Welcome aboard. We'll get you a fancy job title to go over your bunk. I only need a footlocker. Data pad, toothbrush, clean underwear, that'll do. I'll catch up with you. Well, this will be interesting. Now for our new outpost. You have already logged an ideal site. Nav point noted. Updating Tempest. The Nexus is on pins and needles, Ryder. Pods are inbound and ready. Let's go make it happen. to think that if we pull this off, everything we're looking at could change. I like those pre-trip vision paintings of future Eos. Green fields, rivers, forests. Wonder what it'll really be like down the line. Fewer death storms would be nice. Technology Pathfinder. Yes, stay sharp. Oops.
You're telling me. <laughs> you could really handle yourself, kid. And I hear you're the one to thank for clearing up the sky. Had your number all wrong. You're not so bad yourself, old man. Maybe we should work together after all. This fight was pretty good, but you're still Nexus and green as a drill. Still, something tells me you've got potential. Be ashamed to waste that. I'm in. <laughs> Just point me to your ship and try to keep up. Yeah, you're gonna be my husband. Hey, where'd you go? Don't leave me! The first colonists sent audio logs about these regions back to the Nexus. And? Fairwind's... This is where we'll build our new outpost. A real beginning. Prepping deployment order. You must choose what purpose this new outpost will serve. The Nexus doesn't get a say? Resources are at a crisis point. Protocol states this judgment call falls to the Pathfinder. With current supplies, you could build a military outpost focusing on defense and militia training. Alternatively, a scientific outpost could advance the initiative's research and discoveries. What do you think? Military outpost or scientific? I say scientific. Aren't we here to explore? I say military. There's too many threats out here. Be advised that the first outpost placed by a Pathfinder will be a statement in itself. Fair or not, your choice will represent the initiative and its intentions in Andromeda. Consider carefully. I'm choosing what Vedra says because she's my wife. Prioritize research and discovery. <laughs> That's our foundation. And our future. Orders prepped. Ready on your signal. Radiation level. Andromeda Initiative, this is Ryder. Pathfinder. EOS is ready for deployment. Copy that. Outpost block inbound. And ready as hell. August Bradley, operational head for this block. Mayor now, I suppose. We're ready to make the most of what you delivered. I feel like I should toss you the keys. Be nice. It's been through a lot. Understood. Prodromos. That's what we're calling her. They're eager. I haven't seen eager for months. Eos is far from golden. But now it's a producer. A real and reasonable first step. They think you did the impossible. The Nexus. I warned them, hoping was... 
Irresponsible. You proved me wrong, Pathfinder. What are you playing at? Seems like being my friend is suddenly valuable. Fair assumption. The reality, Ryder? You brought us time. But one outpost on a long-shot planet won't stop us from starving. You already have a lead on... something else? The nav point from the... vault. Now it gets complicated. The others are ready to officially sanction your efforts, to be a part of your success. We all want the initiative to succeed. But after failing for so long, no one agrees on how to do it. Be aware, that's all. We didn't come to a new galaxy to argue about who's right. It got us this far. Talk to Bradley. Later, we'll go over the extended job of Pathfinder. Until then. Tan's waiting on the Nexus. Come on, man, really? Sent his go. Leaving Atmel. All clear. Before the meeting gets started, I have bunk assignments for PB and Drac. Already put my rucksack in the kitchen. I'll hang out there if that's okay. <laughs> what the and fuck? I'm in one of the escape pods. More my speed. That's fantastic. Welcome aboard. Any thoughts, Ryder? We're adventurers. Whatever makes the squad comfortable is okay with me. Let's talk about our success on EOS. Besides establishing our first viable outpost, we did some amazing things. We discovered the Remnant and breached their vault. And didn't get killed. Overcame radiation poisoning a number of times. And didn't die. Confronted by Ket at every turn. Once again, did not get killed. You guys really need to raise the bar on what you call success. <laughs> yeah, should we use the Krogan definition of success that got your homeworld nuked by your own people? <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Let's focus. Back to the task at hand. Looking forward. Exactly. Here's my only question. When do we hit that next vault? It looked active. We have to get on that. Hang on, hang on. We need to not go off half-cocked. There are initiative priorities. The team calls the shots. Actually, the Pathfinder calls the shots, just to be clear. So what do you need from us, Ryder? Let's be kind and give each other the benefit of the doubt. Finding a home for tens of thousands in this hellscape is stressful enough without adding dysfunction. You got it, boss. If Krogan are known for one thing, it's getting along. But not humility or self-awareness. 
Okay, let's head back to the Nexus. PB, Drac, see Lexi for a physical. Good meeting, everyone. We call Ryan. this the research when room. You've got a minute, you can stop run by research projects and coordinate with the Nexus from here. We haven't really spoken since orientation. No. Our tech lab is an engineer's dream. It's perfect for any delicate technical work. Nice place you found. Clean air, plants, helps me think. Something on your mind? <sighs> Maybe. What the hell was that? <sighs> I know that look. It's just my biotics reacting to all this. I don't normally lose it like that. A huntress should have better control. Huntress? Another term for an Asari commando. I was one, before the initiative. Some things stick, though. Like losing the old man. I know it's not the same, but I'm a good listener. I hope you're as good at being Pathfinder. I said I wouldn't get in the way, and I meant it. But I prepped for years as your father's second. Then he chooses you, an untrained Pathfinder, and all this mess to fix? the hell was he thinking? Is this going to be a problem, Cora? I don't want a rival. Just answers. It, it's done. Best I can do now is be your second. Keep your father's mission alive. Then maybe we'll all get what we came out here for. Even if we get there, there's a mountain of hard work ahead. Working hard was never my problem. Biotics like this. Thinking like an Asari huntress. I never had a place. Best I could be was a useful freak. The initiative was meant to be different. Will be different if this mission succeeds. So I'm seeing it through. It's quiet in here. I can keep the plants watered while I work. First job, see if there's any news on the Asari Ark. If they made it, we could use some Asari expertise. If you want to talk, I'll be here. 
No, I don't want to talk to you. Where's my baby girl? These are the Pathfinder's quarters. Your quarters. Sam's router is down there too. Pathfinder rider to engineering. Repeat, rider to engineering. <laughs> Pathfinder, help me with something? I know, not exactly standard. Gotta make the space comfortable. Plus, the fabric diffuses the charge from an overclocked Omni blade. Not giving up a 6% boost, right? Right, right. What? Never mind. BS for the requisition. So, finally time for that beer? And after two years and a dozen suspensions, I took a lateral promotion out of the force. Being a cop just didn't fit. But crisis response? Digging people out of trouble? That worked. I bet Hustle followed you into a few peace actions. Think about your alliance days much? I wanted adventure and mystery at the edge of known space. There was so much to see. Seems like a long time ago. 600 years, give or take. So, Pathfinder. Why Andromeda? That blunt, huh? That blunt. I hoped my Alliance career would lead to adventure, exploring, hunting dangers in the dark. Didn't happen. Couldn't. But here, everything's new. And I want to see it all. Oh, I don't hear idealist a lot. Everyone's cynical. Back at you, Costa. Why'd you come? I want to say I'm running from my past, but really running from myself. That'd be a great story. But it's bullshit. I had family, friends, a good enough job, nothing was wrong. I just heard about the initiative and... I believed in it. I believed in a new beginning. Still do. I have to. We're in it. We can't go back. But we're not trapped by decisions a galaxy behind us. I don't feel trapped. We came from a good place for good reasons. We keep that in mind or steer us right, just like back in Crisis Response. Remember the essentials. A new start guided by the Pathfinder. And team. I'll bust my tail to make that a good story. <laughs> Just stick it in his nose.